Why are you on the computer? You're having a baby! Will there be one? Will there be two? Will there be three? I just close my eyes and dream about our kids and how they're running around. Won't you come and lay down next to me? Close your eyes and we'll be free. Hello! All you fabulous and wonderful people welcome back to the channel and welcome to one of the very last episodes of this challenge we only have a couple more so yeah we're here on wednesday here so yeah just literally oh this could be the last episode i don't know i i don't think it will be uh, I think it'll be the next to last. But anyways, um, so I popped in here with Erin and Fatu to give their apartment a little makeover, to get it ready for the baby. Um, and also I wanted to check to see if she was getting closer to having the baby. And we have just caught them at the right moment. So let me show you what I've done to the apartment. First of all, Fatu is feeling tense. Another thing here, Erin, I don't know why she is in, dressed as a ninja bunny. I don't know. I don't know why she's dressed this way. This is the way I came in here and here she is. And isn't that the weirdest baby bump you've ever seen? <laughs> okay, but since we're right here, I'll show you guys I really give their, their place a makeover here. I really like it. So here's the living room here. It's looking like this, full of lots of stuff. And I guess I was in the mood to decorate. I also didn't realize that this apartment had this um, in memory of Walden White, the historical plaque um, of the landlord here, I guess. But you can't remove it, so there it is. And then this is the kitchen and uh, dining room. Then in here, I did split their room and I created a little baby room, but this is how their bedroom is looking now. And I also couldn't fit curtains on here. I had that problem again where it kept wanting to snap to the top, so I just had to leave them off. And I added a little desk for them here. Now here is the baby's room. I pretty much went with like neutral, so it could be for a boy or girl because I don't know what they're having. They just got a little, um, you know, bathing station here and some decor, their little crib here and, or bassinet, I should say. And then over here, we've got like a little dresser and a little um, seating kind of area under the window and then some toys there. That's so cute. I really like it. So this is it. This is her little baby's room. So she is also in labor. She's going to have this baby in two hours. It is go time. Also, I noticed I was looking at her stuff. She's been working hard at this acting skill because she's level nine. Yo, I believe she was level five when we left her. So she has been promoted. So she's been really working at that apparently. And now she's having this baby. I don't know why she's dressed this way, but we we gonna change it, of course. Now, I did give her a small makeover. I was just kind of playing around last episode, but I didn't really show it, partially because I kind of forgot about it because I was so upset that I had forgotten about the pandemic and all that happening. So I did change. I think I just changed her every day. Yeah, I put her in this as her every day. Now, I don't, I, I like this hair for her. So that's why I kind of left it. I, I don't have a lot of hairs, but I think she looks cute in this hair. But this is the, this is her main outfit. So I guess we're going to go have ourselves a baby, a baby right off the bat. I'm really excited. I can't wait to see what she's going to have. She might be only having one. One in there but it is time it is time so let us have her go ahead and have this baby and we are going to have this baby at the hospital here oh she's sick we are going to join her and she's automatically changed into this outfit with this hair I, I don't even have this hair on her my game just put it on there okay whatever it is what it is what a scary time to be having a baby really right? Because this is the first half of 2021. How do I check in? There's nobody here. There's nobody here. She's going straight for it. She's like, uh, uh, we're, all, we're already checked in. Let's just go. Let's just go. We're already checked in. Wait a minute. What is Fatu doing? Why are you on the computer? You're having a baby. Oh my goodness. Okay, now he's gonna freak out. 
He went straight for the computer, but two. Will there be one? Will there be two? Will there be three? I doubt there's three, but maybe two. And it's a boy. So she had a baby boy. So I kind of asked for names um, in a couple videos ago, I guess when we found out she was pregnant. And one of you guys had given me two names, one for girl and one for a boy. And the boy's name was Liam. I really like that name. So we're going to name him Liam Williams. I like that a lot. So there we go. Oh, and we did have twins. It's a girl. So we're going to go with the girl's name that I'm sorry. I'm really bad with names, but whoever recommended this, thank you. We're going to go with Olivia. I really love that name. Olivia. I think that's how you spell it, right? Oh my gosh. So we had one boy and one girl. I had a feeling that she might have twins because she was like really really big i'm so happy for her she had twins how exciting and he's just standing here he's like oh there's two what am i gonna do with that oh dear all right it's time to stick them in your pocket and go yep it's time to go home well i guess i have to get a second baby bassinet now don't i there is our babies just floating here okay so here i just went ahead and got this crib put you in here Little, I think that's the girl. I think that's little Olivia. And here's Liam. Oh, and this thing moves. I didn't realize that this little mobile um, actually moves. There they are. And he has this. Oh, the baby's here. That's it. Now Fatou has a new baby. It looks acceptably cute and will have a new dynamic to Fatou's life sometimes change is welcome so he seems pretty happy about the new babies and they're twins oh i love it i love it i'm glad that somebody had twins because you know multiples do run in the family so yeah that is really cute so if you remember angie was not very far after erin she was only a couple hours behind so we're gonna go pop in really quick to see if she had her baby because i think she probably did she was just a couple hours behind erin here so we're gonna go check on them i hate to leave these ones we'll be back don't worry because these two are gonna be having a wedding later this day so they just eat it is only five o'clock in the morning. All right, here, let's go check on Angie. Okay, yep, so guess what? Angie has had her baby. So it looks like she had a little girl. Let's go see where this baby is. Alana Ito, I actually like Alana. That is pretty name. They need like a baby bed now, don't they? So this is the first little baby girl for Angie who has a stinky diaper. I think what we are gonna do first is pop into Cass really quick and we're gonna get their wedding out fit set straight and I'm gonna fix her every day and stuff because I really didn't give her much of a look I wasn't I'm not happy with her makeover that I gave her so we'll see this actually is not bad I don't I like this I think it's this hair I could have swore I had on the black one but maybe not okay let's see what I have for hairs because I'm not entirely happy with this oh that's nice that's really cute I'm not feeling that one for her I think I actually really like this one. I think I'm gonna go with this one. We've got her masks there. Let's get rid of the necklace. What am I doing right here? Necklace, there we go. So it's the same outfit, but it just is with the mask instead. Now I feel like I wanna change the color of this mask. You know what? We're just gonna go with the white mask. For her wedding dress, let's see. Maybe she would wear uh, pants. Um, that's all right. That's nice. No, this one's kind of nice. I actually really like this dress on her. Maybe she would have gloves. There we go. I think that looks really pretty. So I think this will be her wedding outfit. She's actually going to need a mask because, you know, it is the first part of 2021 and I just feel like they would be masks, so we'll get this white mask for her. There we go. So for Fatou, for his formal, we have this. We're going to actually use, I think, that new um, suit that came with the wedding pack. I think we will go with, this is what we're gonna go with, but I also forgot that I think there is some like flower. So I forgot all about these. Oh, that's kind of pretty. Yeah, I like that. Her, her colors are gonna be purple. 
even though really it's only the family. It's only a the immediate family that's coming. So yeah, I think that's gonna be his wedding outfit there. Oh, he needs a mask as well, right? I think we'll go with that. Okay, so I think by this point, you know, restrictions have been, um, they're lifted a bit more. And I think she would be able to go over to um, her sisters and uh, see her for a minute. I think we'll just have the two stay here with the babies and we'll go over to our sisters and ask both Takumi and Erica to be in the wedding. Since it's such a small wedding, I don't think we'll like have the whole ring bearer and flower pal. I think she'll we'll just have, you know, her sister and Takumi um, be there for her. Of course, we're gonna have the, you know, all of the brothers and stuff over. And she's like, hey sister, how are you doing? How's it going? And Erica, where's your mask? Where is your mask? Ask to be a sim of honor at wedding. And Fatou's come over too. Fatou, go take care of the babies. I guess the babies is fine. I guess the babies are fine. It's been so long since we got to talk and see each other. She's like, would you like to be in my wedding? It's just gonna be a small wedding with the family. Erica's like, yeah, of course. And she's enthusing again about the wedding. And Erica is very excited about the wedding. Ask to be sim of honor at the wedding. She's like, thank you so much, Takumi, for being gonna be in our wedding. We are gonna need to have her eat something. And she's just gonna have herself a grilled cheese. Oh no, Erin! <gasps> Don't you dare set this house on fire, this apartment on fire. Um, That does not look very good. Oh, Erin. I think this is some poor, poor quality food. Yep, it is. Oh, well, so that's what you get to eat. There's a high maintenance and now, she is having the worst day ever. Baby Fatou will make it all better. No nap for you, you're on daddy duty. <laughs> so I've been having her, it's almost two o'clock. I've been having her to try and calm herself down and it is just not working. I cannot get her out of this worst day ever and she's still got five hours. Like this calming down does not help. This, this does not help. I don't know what else to do. Maybe if I've, Maybe she can rock her baby, maybe? Yeah, it is not working. Even holding and rocking her baby is, is doing no good. Oh, it's just gonna be a terrible wedding. I'm just having Erin call Eric over just so we can ask him to officiate our wedding. I did install the mod by Carl Sims that fixes wedding stories, so hopefully that will work. Maybe the whole officiating thing will work. You see he has a different hairstyle. That's because I had to change it because with the masks, it didn't work with the hair. So he has a new little, you know, new hair. As to be efficient at wedding. We'll see if it works. Bottle feed, you're on daddy duty while we get this buddy wedding ready. Hey brother, would you like to be the officiant at our wedding? I would greatly appreciate it. He's like, yeah, I would love to be. Let me just put that mask on. We're gonna plan this wedding here. We've got everything all set and we're gonna put in our Sims of Honor here, Takumi and Erica. Eric is gonna be the officiant. We're not gonna have a ring bearer or flower pal just because it's just gonna be the family. We'll ask all our family over here. Okay, so we got Tyrell, Evan, and Ethan, and Catherine. I don't know why Catherine is dressed this way. I don't know why my game has dressed her this way, but we have got everybody all set for the wedding. And we got Angie. I don't think we'll have Bruno. Bruno will stay home with the baby and everything. So we're all set there. And it's just going to be kind of a quick wedding. We're gonna exchange the vows. We do have a dance floor. I did set that up. Um, a really nice, so we'll we'll have first dance, we'll cut the cake, we'll walk down the aisle, um, we'll have toast, and we'll have a celebration feast. And that is all we're going to do. It's not gonna be, maybe we'll have some dancing. That will be it, I think. We will have it at the Amesworth residence. See, I have it all set up for them. All right, well, this is a little bit better, okay? Liam and Olivia have been sent to daycare, first of all. At least the bride and groom have shown up in their attire, their dress attire. Everybody else is not. She's not sick. She gets 
a cough after doing physical activity. So I think it's from that. Okay, so I've got them all now changed. Um, so we don't have Ethan. Where is Ethan and Evan is where I'd like to know. Are they, they should be in their house. Yo, and they still have their room as for little kids. Um, yeah, they have it. I don't know where Ethan and Evan are. We may have to, they might show up later because I, they do spawn in pretty slowly. I think I'm gonna group them. I don't know where she's going. I don't know where the bride is going, but I think I'm gonna have them all grouped together. So I think we have enough. One, two, three, four, five, six. I think we can get them all grouped uh, together. So just maybe make things a little bit easier. Um, so let me show you guys really quick what I've done. I did put their, I did fence in their whole yard. This is the new fence that came with the uh, wedding pack. And then I just have the really long aisle because I felt like even the medium length was um, not long enough. And then I just put down chairs for them and I put up the, these pergolas and you know, the wedding arch right here. And then I got like a little dance thing here with some music. And then over here behind the house, I've just got a table with, so we can do the toast. And then we'll put the cake here and then we have our food and the bride and groom can sit here, maybe, if they sit to eat, I don't know. I also did give Erin a laptop. I have not gotten the cake yet. I'm hoping she can get this cake. I didn't want it to spoil. I'm wondering maybe we should do that now before we get started because I wanted, I don't even know, maybe we can't get it, maybe it's too late, I hope not. Uh, I don't think it is. I think we should still be able to purchase wedding cake, yes. Okay, so we have this really pretty purple one. I think this is the one we're gonna go with, but I'm just gonna look and see what their other cake choices are. There's a lot of cakes to choose from. We're gonna go for this one, it's square, I think. A, a square design round wedding cake, white, white with purple and there it is and it is gonna be spoiled in 10 hours is what it last so that is the cake that's interesting you know what i'm very disappointed by this cake i should have gone with the beachy one. Oh well it is what it is so let's put a you know what i don't want anybody to eat this cake you know what let's put this back in our inventory i don't want any oh we can set this for wedding so i think because we already started the wedding and are here we can't set this as the wedding cake i'm fine with that um i am i think i will put a wedding topper on okay so we'll put that back can we put that in our wedding thing oh we can't once the topper is on you cannot put it back in your inventory oh okay Hopefully nobody will take it. Oh, put wedding cake, take cake topper in. Oh, you can inscribe it. We'll leave it. I have to say I'm not a very big fan of the toppers. I should have gone with just like a regular topper. It's okay. It's okay. We're going to leave it. And everybody is here. I've just seen Fatu is like, does not like Ethan or Evan. Like, what has happened to this relationship? Despise, things have gone awry with this relationship. Can it be salvaged? <gasps> I don't know why they don't get along. Dislike, this relationship is tense. Things are going are likely to go awry. I don't know what is going on there. We'll first have everybody, please take your seats. Let's see if they take their seats. Now, if you remember last time at Erica's wedding, they danced off on the side. <gasps> They're all sitting. Yo, wait a minute. They're all sitting. I can't believe it. I cannot believe it. They're all actually sitting. Erica might walk down twice, yo, because I um, messed up. I meant to send them together. Oh, we meant to send them together. Why is she crying? So I think that the two walk down two sims does not work. So... We'll send down Takumi. He gets up out of his seat. He gets up out of his seat, yo. Okay, and there he is. Look at, there he goes. Oh, she's taking a picture of her husband. <gasps> That's funny. All right, we're gonna go ahead and send down. Um, we're gonna send down the bride to Sims. We're gonna have dad and Erin. Um, we'll see if this works. 
Yeah, I don't, I'm, I don't think, I don't think that the toll, yeah, it's not gonna work. Um, so let's just send down one. So unfortunately that's not working. Where's our bride? Where's our bride? Here she comes. And there she goes. Oh, by herself. How cute. We're gonna try this with the officiant and kiss. Erica, did we do this to you at your wedding? No. Oh, he got up. <gasps> Wait a minute. He got up, yo. He got up. Okay, so Eric did get up and now they're officiating. We still have Sim standing around dancing though. I'll keep my head high while we're crossing the land. With all the minds we lay down, it's gonna take us some time. But I won't give up, though I know it's tough. We need to break our patterns. It's better now than Drifted off too far. Let's tear down these walls. Our destiny has come. We're walking down a path, and the wind changes at last. Like a song about our past. Oh, and there they go. The two lovebirds are now married. They kissed each other with their mask on. Eric immediately goes and does push-ups. What? Okay, okay, silly. Let's, first of all, let's serve an assortment, right? Or all. What's the difference between assortment and all? We'll do an assortment. I think this is what we did at Erica's and it, there was some vegetarian options. You can fill this fountain with, why can't we do this? Oh, you have to have mixology level three, but we're gonna do fruit punch. It's probably gonna be red, I imagine. Oh, wow, that is, that is some pink punch right there. No, don't take a piece of that. She really wants her cake very badly. So I'm thinking this must be, here, call to meal. Everybody, come on over and have some food. And she's grabbed, she grabbed some of this, whatever that is, I don't know, but it was made by her. Um, we do have some vegetable stuff. Why is nobody getting up? Okay, so I think once they sit, I think they stay, they won't move. So that is a bug, apparently. Eric and Aaron are sitting here. They will not get out of these chairs, unfortunately. Even if I do group activities, they will not come. Like they won't, they won't. Can we like gather for recessional? Oh, there, that worked, that worked. So I did gather for recessional and that worked, that actually worked. We're gonna cut this cake really quick before anybody else. Um, cut cake with Fatu. Okay, so the cut cake does not work. Let's gather for the cake. Why are you talking about death, Eric? Why? I don't know where Takumi is rushing off to but he has booked it there. They, it, that is definitely broken. So I just had them all take a piece. They all took a piece and they're all going over here to sit. No, I don't want you to sit over there. I want you to sit over here, sit together. Oh my goodness. It is still, even with Carl Sims fix, it is still quite broken. Um, there are, seems like we have different bugs than we did before, but it is still pretty, pretty broken. There they go. They're all just sitting here enjoying the, their cake here. Oh, there's the bride. Cherry took a bite. She's like, oh, y'all gonna sit over here? I'll sit down too. So while we're here, we're gonna go ahead and have Fatu make a toast to the best marriage. Maybe live long and happy together. Okay, so we've got that. And so now it is 11 o'clock. You're not gonna play games. You're gonna come over here and you're going to have the first dance. Let's see if this is gonna work. Angie, you, there's food over there. You can go. And we're gonna try and have a slow dance. The half at the first dance, I don't think works. Oh, there it is. They're not on the dance floor. Not quite quiet on the dance floor, but there they're having their first slow dance and everybody's joining in. And there we go, they're dancing up into the night. The, it's dark out, but yay. They're still happy. They're like, hey, amongst all the bad things that have been happening, we can at least have a nice family get together and dance. Boy, Erin be getting down. I don't know where Erica is. Oh, there she is. She's sitting down. Erica's like, nah. I'm gonna sit this one out. 
I, I, I'm just too tired, you know. So Fatu has this, he's tense. Extrovert war in progress. Who will give up? It won't be me. I am the ultimate extrovert. And the battle begins. Who will be the loudest in their room? So he feels like he's not being heard, I think. So we got everything all done, but cut the cake. It didn't work. I don't know why they're all so upset. Look at Angie. Oh my gosh, Angie. It looked like Catherine was holding her hip while she was dancing. <gasps> Wow, Tyrell. Oh, Takumi. Okay. Okay. Y'all and your crazy dances. Oh, and then Erica. Look at Erica go. She's like, yeah, I'm going. Bye-bye. I'm done. That's it. I'm out. All right. Well, I think it is it is 1.30 in the morning. And we've done pretty much everything but eat. I know I couldn't get the guests to all eat their food. So I think we're going to go ahead and end this and say it was a pretty decent wedding despite everything going on, you know, with the pandemic. At least we were able to have the family get together and have some kind of a nice wedding here. So I think they're going to go ahead and head home now she was just coughing but i it's from doing physical activity maybe it was from the dancing i don't really know but your babies are back and you can come in here and um rock them and take care of them and fatu come home he's like i wasn't ready for that wedding to end i feel like dancing i'm just getting started she's like well honey let's go ahead and you know go to bed we'll have our wedding night woohoos so we're gonna go ahead and leave them I think they're just gonna have their wedding night Ooh, woo -hoo. So, but they're very very happy look at that very happy just married had our babies on these babies do be looking so cute look at them they're like look kind of lifeless to be honest okay so we're over here let me pause this um I just popped over here to see she's gonna be in her third trimester in five hours I can't believe it and she's losing her focus where is she oh she's in here so I am going to go ahead and end this episode here. So we have one more video left, you guys. One more video left. We have come down to the end here. So we will most likely be having the baby. So before that video, I will fix up a baby's room and get this room all situated and change it around. So we'll be prepared for the new baby or babies. I think it would be really cool if she was pregnant with twins. I doubt she is. We'll have to see. So Aaron and Fatu are now married and they are happy over there. I hope you guys liked this video. If you did, be sure to give it a big thumbs up. If you haven't yet subscribed, it would be amazing if you did. And also don't forget to click the little bell to get notified whenever I have a video go up. And I hope you all have a great rest of your day. And I will see you in the next video. Bye. So I just close my eyes.